the impact of the short family murders shook not only the Henry County community, but also across Virginia and North Carolina. New at 6, 10 News reporter Courtney Lockey joins us live after speaking with friends of the family who still struggle with it almost 20 years later. Courtney. Guys, I'm in the area where the Shorts house used to be, just behind this abandoned convenience store right off of 220 in Collinsville. It burned down in 2019, but tonight, for the first time in nearly two decades, family friends tell me they feel like there's a real shot at finding peace. It's got hard on them. This not being solved is really hard on the family. Questions surrounding the death of the Shorts weighs heavily on the minds of family and friends every day, including longtime neighbor Ray Reynolds, who remembers the last day he saw them. It was a little convenient, so we always stopped and we'd get food and uh, get groceries. Just that night I came home, I saw her in there with her dad and they were getting something to eat and uh, just, you know, she's like everything was normal. Not 24 hours later, Michael and Mary were killed in their home and their nine-year-old daughter Jennifer was missing. Six weeks later, her body was found in North Carolina. We thought she'd be found safe. I had no idea that they would find remains. No one was, no one was prepared for that, no one. After 20 years, Ray wonders if he'll ever really know what happened to the Short family that night. But as news of investigators taking a new look at the case spreads through the whole town, so does Hope. Did a lot of damage to our community. A lot of people had to move away because of it. If this was solved, it'd be the biggest healing process that we have went through. A more than $60,000 reward is being offered for anyone who can offer information that would lead to an arrest. And as Annie said before, if you know something, call the sheriff's office. Reporting live tonight in Henry County, Courtney Lockie, 10 News, working for you. And we're working for you to get the latest updates on this cold case information. You can track any new information online at WSLS.com and by downloading our 10 News mobile app.